Hi guys. Uh, I'm back. Okay. Uh, right now we're gonna go over reaching for um weapons. Oh, most chairman. Okay. Um, for example, um, I got my spine cutter fixed right here. Um, let's say, you know, someone's acting aggressive. So, and you have no no choice but to pull your weapon. Uh, put a, put a hand out as a, a, a barrier, you know, uh, but not so far out so they can, you know, do all sorts of nasty, painful stuff. Put it out to block or whatever, and then, boom, 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 okay, so there's the knife. Uh, side of it. Okay. Let me, let me take that off. Okay. So, what weapons? Okay. I recommend. Not putting in your seatbelt. So I, the only thing I put in my seatbelt or, or uh, sword, sword uh, scabbers because I can, uh, you know, pretty much make sure that the scabbard stays there and then I can pull my sword. That being said, I can't legally carry a sword. So uh, when you come, when when in the case of Sticks or uh, something like the Tommyknocker, okay, put it beside you on the, on the seat, like I've shown before. Say, hey, dude, I don't want any trouble. Your arm will, will be there with the, your hand, so they really can't tell why your hand is there anyway. And then, boom. And then, Come down, come across, you know, whatever. Okay. So those are two that two examples. What I wouldn't do, which a lot of people um, do mention, okay, um, is putting stuff behind your back. Um, when you're when you're in a chair, uh, I wouldn't do that. Um, when I have my backpack uh, on the the push bars or whatever, whatever the heck they call those, I have no idea. Uh, I, I make it so I can turn around and take the backpack off. Uh, okay, but that's about it. That's the only thing that's that's back there. If if I had a weapon back there, there. There is no way I could reach far back, that far back quick enough, and then do what I need to do. I would be all wide open, as you just saw. Okay, uh, that's a sol a solo flex shot waiting to happen. Okay, uh, so my recommendation is e either around the neck with a neck knife, and option two. Uh, or something here or on the side panel of your armrest. The armrest is a good um, hiding place, I should, should say. Okay. Um, also, uh, under, underneath the seat is a good place to hide stuff, but if, if you need to. Um, Quickly draw something. I wouldn't do it. Okay. I mean, you're doing this, and there's no way you can, you know, come back up that quickly. So, rem remember to the side, or you know, or or on you in some 
way. Okay, so that's that's the lesson for today. Uh, where to put your weapons and what to carry. Okay, uh, I don't know whether uh, Primal Punch is going to make any more time after, but if he does, get him. And um, dirty room knives, uh, knives are very, very good for um, self-defense, especially the spine cutters. That's why I picked that one. Okay, uh, Gear Bastion, dirty room knives. Check him out. He's a good dude. Okay. Um, that's about it, guys. Uh, again, send me re requests and let me know what you want to see. I, you know, I, my my videos are ideas that pop into my head, and uh, I just do, uh, I just do the videos. Okay, uh, that's that's the way I do things. Okay, so uh, be safe. Don't and don't do anything I wouldn't do.